All right, welcome back. Let's get things rolling after this morning. We're pretty much quiet here across the Northwest. There's a few exceptions to that, though. We do have some snow flurries falling. That's no big deal. But the wind is kind of the name of the game this morning. So our actual air temperatures are in the lower 20s to start things off. A few middle 20s further down to the south. So these temperatures may look okay, though. But you factor in the wind, which is reaching up around 20 to 25 miles per hour sustained, making it feel like this outside. It's making it feel like we're at around 6 degrees in Rhinelander, 7 degrees in Anago, and a few other areas so especially along highway 51 that feels like we're in the teens out there so definitely make sure to have those winter coats ready you want to keep those handy as you want to bundle up as you do head out the door here are those winds that may make travel a little bit tricky from time to time too on the west and the southwest at around 20 to 25 miles per hour in a few spots these are the sustained winds so that's measured over a certain amount of time here is the actual gusty winds the outliers though with some gusts reaching close to 40 miles per hour stopping just short in Rhinelander at around 30 seven miles per hour so the winds have been gusty after this morning we have had gusts up to 40 miles per hour don't be surprised if your lights do flicker today as a result of the wind with the trees already stressed out from the recent active weather that we've had otherwise though the gusty winds continue today and maybe getting a little bit stronger again gusts up to 40 miles per hour will be expected though but the good news is things start to relax later on this evening and parts of tomorrow maybe some wind gusts only at about 10 miles per hour by tomorrow now be about it so there will be some improvement on the way we just got to wait until later on tonight for that to move in. We have a high as 48 degrees. We'll reach for the lower 30s today only. But the good news is we're going to start warming things up rather dramatically, though. Pretty much a 30 degree change between today and then the 40s by Saturday. And then the 60s making their return. We haven't seen these in a while, right? As we head towards next week, even 67 degrees by next Wednesday. That will feel very nice. A big 180 compared to these 30s that we've been experiencing out there, or at least for the high temperatures coming up later today and what we've had recently. But there are some wind alerts over in parts of the UP, some high wind warnings, the wind advisories in the UP lasting until 7 p.m. this evening. So if you're heading out there, definitely make sure to keep that in mind. It might make travel a little bit tricky from time to time and maybe stressing those trees out. But we do have some snow flurries that are developing as well with that this morning as we do have that area at low pressure that's been bringing all the active weather with us. It's now tracking off towards the north and east. You can see it right about in there. So we're going to be seeing this moving away. We have high pressure right about in here. So some improvement will be on the way soon. We just had to give it us a little bit of extra time. So future cast for today, a mostly cloudy sky. There's a few snow flurries right there for today. By tonight, we start to relax. This tries to get something going. I do think we'll stay mostly clear later on tonight. But clouds do move in for the daytime tomorrow. Lower 30s today, mostly cloudy. A few snow flurries out there. Also windy. West wind getting up to about 40 miles per hour. Tonight, here we are. The wind swing out of the southwest as we fall at around 10 degrees. Mostly clear and still breezy. Some guys up to 40 miles per hour at times. But that will start to back off as we do proceed forward into the overnight period. Northwoods Furniture and Max. For a seven-day forecast. Moving forward, though, Easter Sunday is getting close, and look, it's going to be pretty nice. Mostly cloudy temperatures in the mid-50s by that point. Beforehand, though, good Friday, mostly cloudy, highest in the lower 40s. We do have the snow that will be moving in Friday night into parts of Saturday. But dry next week as temperatures start to feel like spring.